The glorious 12th of August signals the start of the annual grouse shooting season. People come from all over the world to shoot grouse in the UK, generating millions of pounds and providing a much needed boost for local economies. Red grouse are highly prized, a wild bird flying at up to 70 miles an hour, which can only breed on the UK's heather moorland. It's thanks to the grouse and grouse shooting that moorland is maintained and managed. The grouse itself, it can only survive in these moorland habitats. He's a totally wild bird. It can't be artificially reared. It's very, very difficult to artificially feed them. Not only do we create suitable habitat for the grouse, we create an excellent habitat for all the other birds which live on the moor. The lapwings, the curlews, the meadow pipits, the skylarks, they all have an important role on the moor. Not only does it create some revenue for the boss, who puts a lot of money into this moor, but when the guns come to stay, they stay in the local hotels, they spend money in the local shops, the local pub does well. It, it's a big knock-on effect. Without the grouse shooting, a lot of things would, would suffer. The grouse are the main reason the landowners put the time and the money into these moors. And through doing that, everything benefits. I think grouse has is, is quite rightly got the name the king of all game birds, hasn't it? It's, it's the most difficult to shoot. It's, it's one of our wildest game birds that we've got. Um, the the flavours are fabulous, you know, and, it, and it's, it's just a wonderful, wonderful product. It, I think it symbolises everything that's great and good about the British countryside to me. I think if I was cooking a grouse at home, um, I would very, very simply pan roast it, um, give it 10 or 15 minutes in the oven with some roast potatoes, game chips, some lovely bread sauce and a little bit of watercress. That would do it, yeah. Good lad, no biting. Hop, hop, hop. The grouse season lasts for just a few short Boy. weeks. And it's mainly thanks to shooting, to the gamekeepers and the moor owners, that this precious moorland habitat is maintained. The moorland habitat we have in this area is, is unique to Britain. We don't have it anywhere else in the world. It is our rainforest. If we don't look after it, if we don't manage it, it'll be gone.